Hello dear students, in previous classes we learned the numbers 1 to 9. Now tell me which number comes after 9? Good, the number after 9 is 10. Today we are going to learn introduction and writing of number 10 and let us learn tens from Page number 38 and 39. 9 and 1 make 10. 9 plus 1 is equal to 10. To understand this concept easily, let's look some examples. There are 9 crayons. In that, we add 1 crayon. Then how many crayons are there? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 and 10. 9 and 1 make 10. There are total 10 crayons. 9 plus 1 is equal to 10. Bagha 9 madhe ek milavilyan antar dhahanka milto. Now look, there are 9 flowers. We add 1 flower in it. 9 and 1 make 10. There are 10 flowers altogether. Now look at the matchsticks. There are also 9 matchsticks and we add 1 matchstick in it. The total matchsticks are 10. 1 to 9, each number has a unique sign. 0 has an oval ring that is fine. Baga, ek te nau ya pratyek ankala swathacha asa ek chinna hai and 0 ha oval akaracha gula hai. We want no more signs to memorize. To write all numbers is an easy exercise. How can we write then the next number 10? 10 is how it's written. 1 to 9 numbers and 0. Ya pasunas pudil serva sankhya tayar hotat. Tatilas first two digit number ahe 10. Now let's learn how to write number 10. The number 10 is made from 1 and 0. How to write look? Slight slanting line, then a straight line and a short horizontal line that makes 1. After that, one oval shape circle is written that makes 0. 1 and 0, this number is 10. Now let us learn tens. 10 units gathered together, let us make a bunch of them. Tie them into a bundle and keep on the left side. Note that a 10 is a set of 10 singletons together. When they were single, they were called a units. And when we make the bunch of them, then it is called as 10. It is shifted in the house of 10 on the left side and 0 is written in the right side because 10 units is equal to 110. The bundle of 10 units become 110 
so one is written in tens block and zero is written in units block when we make a bundle of 10 zero units are remained so zero is written in units place now look the example there are 10 flowers we make a bunch of them it become one tens when we make one ten there are zero units because one bundle is made from that ten units so zero is written in unit place and one is written in tens place one bundle on the left side is a ten a ten means a bundle of ten units or singles nothing is left in units house so we write zero in it a ten has one ten and zero units and so the number 10 is written as 1010 there are 10 bids these are single bids these are units when we make a string of them it becomes a string of 10 bids that is 110 when they are single they are units but when we bind them in a bundle or a string it becomes a ten so we can write one in tens place and zero in units place by using different examples we learn the concept of a tens thank you